I also have this game called Milk Inside a Bag of Milk Inside a Bag of Milk. Let's play that one. Fuck okay. it. Fuck it. We're gonna play Milk Inside a Bag of Milk. Let's see. I have no idea what this game is about. Let me capture the game. Oh, there you go. Oh, it's not full window. Um, can I put it? Oh, there you go. Uh, we're gonna play on English Improve Original. Got an S in Gaza Dawn. I saw that. 30 minutes. Job. I saw it's that it's that <laughs> English improve or English original. It looks like a Russian game, maybe. So I'm kind of scared. Let's do improved. I want to understand what's happening. Nikita Kaff publishing. Made by Nikita Kriukov. Okay. Help me buy milk. He needs some milk. No. Okay. Write down your name, bro. Is this going to be one of those games that is going to take data from my PC and shit? It's going to read my files and guess my real name and guess my family name. And then it's going to guess my bank account. And then it's going to steal all my money. And they're going to send a hate man and kill all my fucking family and me. This is what that kind of game is? Oh! <sighs> Enrico. Is that boys Enrico's? Is that you? Oh yeah, baby. Bring me the milk. Your name address. Interesting graphics. Oh, it's more we're gonna be like a story game. Okay, okay, okay. I walked down the road to the store and rehearsed my speech. It's been so long since I have been out of the house that I completely forgot what words to say when entering a store. I've been there. I'm going to the store. Who are you talking to? Shut up and go already. Or am I talking to myself? Or am I talking to someone else? Who are you talking to? I'm imagining as if I were a character in a game. <laughs> That's so stupid. What if it helps me gather my thoughts? Okay, so he's training, he's like, training his charisma. It's like one of those Sims in the Sims games, they go in front of the mirror and they're like, ah, blah, 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 blah. and then they get charisma points and they get better at the job. That's what they're doing. Or it's like the taxi, taxi driver in front of the mirror. Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? What game? Well, do you know, there are games where you can see the character's thoughts right on the screen, you know? To this social anxiety, yeah. So I thought if somebody, if someone is reading my mind, I need to be very focused so I don't blur it out too much. Haha. <laughs> imagine, imagine guys, our thoughts were like, we had no filters or would you could see like a, a like a bubble. That was so funny. Have you guys watched the movie? I'm sorry, I'm so <laughs> distracting from the gameplay. Uh, there's this movie called The Invention of Lying. It's so funny. It's kind of like that, I guess. I take a deep breath of air. Hello, can I? Dot, dot, dot. Crap, I forgot. 19th attempt. And I'm feeling it again. I bite my lip in frustration. So once again, 
Hello, can I get... Wow, there's a whole war more. Congratulations. Thank you, I'm trying my best. I think this time the I sound was... Uh, the L sound... The I sound was longer than usual. Bro, you are overthinking too much. Just go and do it. Do you think that's it? Who knows? Hello, can I? Ugh, I wish I hadn't said anything. Haha, <laughs> loser, don't worry. So we can have intrusive bad thoughts or we can have cheerful thoughts. I want to do a positive uh, spiral here. So we're gonna do it with the don't worry. We're gonna, we're gonna be supportive. GG speedrun. Okay. By the way, you have been walking with your left foot on the pavement, on the pavement, on your right foot on the grass for a full minute now. What? My right foot is frozen in the air. How much? 50 steps on the pavement and 51 in the grass. You have to undo the previous step. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So this is a person with severe OCD and tox or like, yeah, obsessive obsessions over small things. And even going to buy milk to the store is like a huge task for them. There's some people who are like this, actually. They're called gamers. They never left the house and they're no life. Uh, any social contact with any other human being is like <clears throat> yeah very <laughs> just kidding <laughs> got <it>. uh. <laughs> how do you how do you imagine that it's not the first time this has happened also they're talking to themselves they're talking within their head a lot they're very introvert not only introvert they're very yeah, they may have even multiple personalities. Social events is the scariest game. Yeah. You are so stupid. Another... Like, the fact that you have this as a possibility, as an option, already tells you the character has intrusive thoughts. Even if you're not picking them, it's like a second voice in your head telling you. You're so stupid, you know? You, you, you try to not listen to it, but it's there. You have been taught the right way, haven't you? Come on. I, I don't remember. I'm ready to burst into tears. They're breaking up. Ugh, here we go again. So, step one. Take a step back to get your foot exactly in your own footprint. Wait a minute, what do you mean step one? What then? But it's already the 50th second. Or wait. I'm going backwards, so then it's 50th? It doesn't add up. Okay, okay. Oh my god. Step 50. Take a step back to get your foot exactly in your own footprint. Could you rephrase it just a little bit? <laughs> you can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't like... Don't talk like that. You are hopeless. I don't like already that we're giving up. We're already giving up into negativity. You guys have to be more patient, give me more chance. People who are like this need a lot more time and patience than this. You cannot... You have to play the game a little bit enough so you help them get out of there. But yeah, I don't like we already are saying uh, something negative you make it sound like it's my fault the store is closest in an hour so you'll be very very guilty if you don't buy milk damn really well are you ready hell yes i carefully move my foot backward looking carefully into the dense grass just dreams come true yeah there you go thank you Lou for that we needed that this need the fucking slap in the face fucking wake up motherfucker
What what if all have these boys, but we learn to shut them up before they can complete the sentence? Ooh, nice theory. We block them. As I enter the store, I turn to the first person I see. Okay, let's do the greeting time, the human interaction. Here we go. Let's see how this goes. Just act normal. Act normal. It's okay. Let's just relax. Hello, can I? What the hell is this? Is that a bird? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? What do I have to do here? Excuse me, what? Oh! Excuse me, what? Oh! Oh my god! Okay, it's happening! Everybody stay calm! What's the procedure, everyone? What's the procedure? Stay calm! Thank you for the 11 beats. That makes it to... 30. 30. Need 20 more beats for a bean. Thank you for the beats, Loon. Can I have some milk? <laughs> Is that what you want? You shouldn't have done that. I'm not making you eat bean today. Well, maybe someone else is. And you contributed to that. <laughs> He's obviously not going to change his lines. You run the risk of ending up in an endless loop. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? What do I do? Hey. And that's very small. Excuse me, what? Oh. What? Oh. <laughs> what is it trying to tell you? He's trying to scare me, but how does he know that I am terrified by the letter O? What's so scary about it? I have a frightening image when I picture it in my head. There is no O's in this sentence. So the character is scared of the letter O. Another reason I need the camera on my phone? Open my bank services? Do they need like a picture of you or something? I can show you, explaining won't be enough, but keep... So that's what they imagine when they scare of the letter O. Something like that. So I'll just continue to ignore his question. What? Oh. Why do they know that I, that scares me and why do they keep repeating it? What? Oh. What? Oh. You can scroll through the text. Oh. What? Oh, I gather all my will into a fist. Oh? What's the mark? Oh! My interlocutor shook and crawled away. Jesus repeated after him. And it worked. Do it more often. Wait, I said he crawled away. Did he? Really crawl away? I mean, I didn't even look in his direction. When exactly did you say that? Holy shit, man, this game is fucking with my mind. Because there is some text that have the quote unquote, as in like a character is talking, 
And then there's other text without the quote unquote as in, as if it was like a third person narrator, right? Like it's a like a narrator, not the character. But then the narrator say that, and the character is acknowledging that. So that's why they're saying, when exactly did you say that? Just now, you see, this has quote-unquote. But this... This... Doesn't have the quote-unquote. My interlocutor shook away and crawl away. And then they say... Do you really crawl away? Yeah. Just now, personally, I didn't hear it. George is trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. Okay, now they're breaking the fourth the fourth wall. I'm standing by the shelves. On the rack there are bags of milk. We both stand and the milk lies. Or maybe. What do you guys do you guys drink milk? And if so, what kind of milk? Full semi, no fat, soy milk, nuts milk, rice milk, almond milk, my cum, 3% fat, I'm not another percentage of the fat I, I drink, but yeah, not full for sure. I drink only pilk. I don't know which one that is. Is that a brand of milk? Hey, hey, slow down. Did you even remember why you're here? To buy milk. So buy it. Right here? What do you expect me to say? Um, I guess something like, not here. You're getting on my nerves. Not here. Take the bag and go to the cash register. There you go. What the fuck is that, Polygon? That's disgusting, bro. I guess the first sentence. And you, as if out of spite, didn't pause before the second one. Do you want to rob me of my little victories? I sighed and reached out to take the milk. Or rather, the bag with the milk inside. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk. Yeah, because... It's a bag of milk with a brick of milk inside, which has the milk inside the brick of the bag. Thank you, Baby Bell Register Nurse for the lark. And uh, good luck with a little nightmares. <laughs> In Romania, they had milks on bags. <laughs> okay. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag. Bro. No. Come on, come on. 15 minutes before the store closes. <laughs> Just to suffer. <laughs> 15 minutes before the store closes. Hurry up. I feel we are sometimes fucking up the game and other times announcing the experience. <laughs> I remember what these games are called visual novels. What are you talking about, bro? Breaking RP. Ban. And by the way, the numbers are written there in full with the, with letters. Are visual novels worse than books? But their authors, but, but they're there, but they're, but there, the authors are not lazy, so don't get lazy either. 
Wait, I thought only your thoughts were visible on the screen. Not anymore, so what's your mouth? <laughs> Bro, what if we have been talking to a little monkey on our shoulder this whole time? Or we have like an evil twin, or like we are these kind of twins that are like together, what are they called? He's pretending to be in a game, in a game, in a game. <laughs> huh? Um. <laughs> anyway, you heard me. Hurry up, or you will get it at home again. I'm on my way. Hello. C can I get s some milk, please? So. We're so scared of people that we see monsters instead. Is that what's happening? Do you have it? Huh. Give. And put a weighty bag on the register. Of course, not just the bag, but the milk too. Ha hi. C can I have it, please? No. Please. No. But please, mom will throw me out of the window if I get back without milk. Oh shit. Who's your co player? Well, bro, what if we are actually. I I'll say something after this game, okay? Let me write it down so I remember. Okay, so maybe we're a little kid that went for milk. No. But why not? Give more. But I don't have anything else. Hey. What? They hate you? You are pathetic? Pay for the milk. Come on, bro. Pay for the milk. Haha, <laughs> really? What would I do without you? I'll take a crump, a crump bill out of the, my pocket and hand it to the cashier. He starts to carefully examine it. Hmm. It took about two days before he nodded contentedly and put it in the cash register. Thank you, goodbye. I wonder what happens if you pick different options. Like, what if you do a bad playthrough and you pick all the options that are bad? Like, what will the character say? Character? These are characters, this is real life. I walk down a familiar street past a gas station. Oh shit, guys. I don't like this. A bag of milk unpleasantly tugs at my hand, reminding me of the days when I was in physical therapy. By the way, they give me a bag at the shake up, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk in an outback. Don't think anything of it. He's loved the pyramidal structure. Of very long constructions. Run! Go! Get to the chopper! The gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Thank you for your interest. I feel like a mile long bar of ice cream. Okay. What is that supposed to mean? As if I'll tell you. But I'm really interested. Well, look, the ratio of water to milk in the volume of air occupied by me is about 30 to 1. And yeah, ice cream is not the best, unless you want to drink more than eat. Anyway, the road from the store to the gas station is a stick. And the road from the gas station to home is ice cream. Hmm. Yes, Polygon, I felt like ice cream. When I sniff it. During today's walk, 
My body has been to every part of this path. Simple math. I see. I feel movement under my feet. Asphalt grains, petrol stains. I'm trying to keep my balance. And how do people move over something as uneven as the city plane? Gently, heel, toe, I count in my mind every meter of the path I walk. I even close my eyes for more concentration. Should not close your eyes while walking on the street, especially near a gas station where you can get drive by a car, but okay. Hey, watch out! Huh? I unconsciously take a sharp step to the side. At the same moment, a huge bear rushes past me with a wild screech. The fuck? Is this Russia? I mean, this is Russia. Take a look. It was made by Nikita. Nikita is in Russia. In Russia, cars don't go to gas station. Bears go to gas stations to buy beer. Hey, I'm walking here. I cast a reproachful glance at the swiftly departing giant. His red eyes, in turn, look at me with mockery. Do you see that? How brazen. Brazen? Brazen? It was a truck. Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there bears, bears with eyes on the back of their heads? You could have died. Come on. Are you saying someone would seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? Okay. The world is a cruel and dangerous place. You are sick. I feel both are true, but the first one is more true than the second. And I'm not saying they are sick as an insult. I'm saying they are sick as an... They are ill. They have a mental illness and they should treat it. Uh, yeah. That will be, be beneficial for their lives. They are a bit weird too, which is not per se bad. They, are, they have a charm to their personality. With this behavior. But uh, they have a little bit of obsession and fear over things that should not be there and they're not gonna let you have a normal life so i'm gonna tell them this even though i would like to develop more on it and not just be plain negative you are sick that sounds like a <laughs> oh yeah rick <laughs> that looks fucking ridiculous <laughs> Uh, yeah. I hope you guys understand me. So I'll pick this one, but it sounds kind of bad. So I'm going to say this because it's more compassionate, I, say, I guess. I'm not in the world you are talking about. Okay. Oh, shit. My journey continues. If you think about it, the road from the store has one interesting property. It adjusts to me in the most bizarre ways. When I'm in a hurry, all the traffic lights turn off healthily. <clears throat> when I feel like crying, a cloud appears over me and pours rain streams that hide my tears. Right now, I can feel a cloud slowly gathering over the top of my head. Or are they gonna cry or something? I'm sad. This game is very psychological. Is it working for you guys? Is it... Is it kind of eerie? It's a bit uncomfy. What do you guys think so far? Before we finish the game, how, what do you guys think of this game so far? I, I, I'm enjoying it. I think it's a very interesting concept. In the shower, nobody can see me cry. Oh. 
Are you sure this this is really happening? What else could it be? Has it ever occurred to you that it's all just in your head? Dot dot dot. No sky at all? I can see the charm of it. That's not what the manual said at all. Oh, what? Apparently, these pills don't work for me either. The pills have nothing to do with it. I want to pick this because dot 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 is like, it doesn't push the conversation forward. And I don't fully agree with this because we're... Yeah, whatever. Please. I just want to get home and go to bed. I really, really am very grateful to you, but please, no more. You have to accept the truth. Uh, they are kind of begging us to leave them alone. So as much as I would like to dig deeper into the truth, I will they give them a break. So maybe they will think about it, and maybe next day or something they will bring it up. When they are comfortable about it, they will bring it up and talk about it themselves. True, you need to do the work in conjunction with pills. Not scary at all. I mean, I can see it's a bit scary. You know what? What? Since I'm a character in a visual novel, I want to talk to whoever is reading this right now. <coughs> Gloop? A gulp? They want to talk to us, guys. Chat, the game wants to talk to you. You are reading this. I want to talk to whoever is reading this right now. You. The chat is next to you. The chat is next to the... There. Guys? They're looking at the... They're looking at the chat. It could hurt your recovery. If you say so. I forcefully squeeze my head with my hands and place a thought block. Out of the corner of my eye, I notice a small bench. The perfect place for cliché visual novel monologues. I move closer. I place a noticeably weighted bag of milk next to it and raise my head to the sky. If they mention me by name, I'm gonna shit my pants. That would be fucking amazing. Imagine this game had Twitch integration, and they can, if you can put, you can uh, introduce your stream, like Quizzer Sevilla in the game, without the chat noticing, without the chat noticing, before you launch the game, okay? Before you start the stream, or whatever. You put the Twitch integration with the chat. And then when you play the game, the chat picks random users, random chatters, and they mention them in the game. That would be amazing. Yo, that is an amazing idea for a video game. I just have right there, by the way. Someone listening? Any game developers? Any game developers listening? Hello? I'm giving you multi-million ideas. Listen to me. Hire me. If they mention me, am I gonna wet my panties? No, no. <laughs> Listen. I'm a little embarrassed. <laughs> I realize that I'm going crazy. The medications are becoming less and less effective, so... Ultimately, things will happen painlessly, I hope. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh, now I feel pity. Do you know what I'm talking about? Uh, it can be multiple diseases, right? Maybe they have dementia. Alzheimer's, schizophrenia, they can have some old, there, there's so many mental illnesses and disorders. Um, I hope it's nothing too severe. And um, they're talking about maybe they will uh, 
And then they say, I hopefully it's painfully. Do you know what I'm talking about? Um, maybe they are thinking about dying. But I'm not 100% sure, so I will say I think so. I think so. I'll be honest with you, and I expect the same from you. Please. Do you know what I'm talking about? No? Well, I'm not really surprised. It must be nothing like the model protagonist at all, huh? Hmm? To be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Sometimes I regret it because now it costs me a lot of effort just to distinguish between letters and words. By the way, if you don't mind, I'll rather not name my diagnosis. Okay? Let at least you be the one who sees me for who I am. I respect that a lot. Even though I made you up, don't take that away from me, okay? Ouch. Ouch. That hurts. So maybe this this character in this game made as the player their copy of mechanism to escape their disease. They made us their their friendly mental voice to deal with the illness. That's very sad, man. That's a very cool concept. Holy shit. Wow. Don't ask me for too much. I won't. I just want you to get milk. How stupid does old seem? From the very beginning, you have been following me, reading my delusional thoughts, hearing my silly conversations. I must seem crazy and weird to you. Haha. <laughs> What is it like to see the world through my eyes? Oh, shit. Ever since <clears throat> something happened, all I see is red. Red blood everywhere. No, don't worry about me. I got used to it a long time ago. Admittedly, I even forgotten what other colors look like. Come on. <laughs> Those monsters from the store, they didn't scare me at all. After all, I know they won't hurt me. Sometimes I think that they themselves are afraid of me. Yo, this game. Wow. Can you imagine that? By the way, if you want to ask me what happened, please don't. Promise? I promise. I'm serious. Of course, you couldn't help but ask. No, I wanted to say yes. But I guess the game didn't register yes. So they took the my promise as if I asked. What happened? I think he's there. Um, I hope they don't get upset though. In the end, I'm just talking to myself. Sooner or later, I will have brought up. So you're really that interested in what happened to me? I won't waste time. What do you see? What do you guys see here? Mm, I don't know. I see you. <laughs> mm. Oh, I see like a woman. I don't know, to be honest. 
I'm not sure. I don't know. Um, maybe if you if you put the right answer. Oh, I see an arrow though. Oh, that's my that's my mouse. <laughs> what the fuck am I saying? Uh, a woman. Dot, dot, dot. Let's see the art department right now. <laughs> anyway, this is my dad. Some of his parts, at least. How oh, fuck? We do have a very difficult family. But despite all the problems, I n never will have thought. Okay, I went from pity to scared. Sorry, I should have raised my voice. Anyway, he jumped out of the window and died. Oh, fuck. This is my last memory. Then a long gap. Oof. Strange. Very strange. Today is the first time I have ever been able to buy something in a store without a major incident. Of course, the medicine helped me. However, I think it's more your merit. Yay, we did it, guys. I kept thinking, we mustn't screw up in front of the reader. Or, oh my god, what will he think? Haha. <laughs> I don't know why I decided to become a visual novel character for the sake of going to the store today, but it clearly paid off. Well, it helped. Let's go! <laughs> Thank you. It's crazy how the mind always comes with mechanisms to just keep going. Preservation and survival. It's crazy. By the way, like yeah repressing memories and thoughts and yeah it's, it's crazy the human mind is is fucking crazy mind-blowing by the way it seems to me that there are some boundaries in your communication that's how i like it haha <laughs> oh they, they removed the box of the communication and yet i have been so sad lately I've been thinking more and more about what my life has become ever since my dad. Well, you know. Day after day, it's the same thing. I've tried so many medications that I hardly feel any difference between them anymore. As long as they help me, they help keep me on my feet, I'm happy. <sighs> but you know what? Today is a special day because I have you. Oh no, guys. They're never gonna let us go. There's so much I want to tell you. Oh. That was very rude of you. Oh no. I'm not going to pressure you. I'm just advising you to go home. Oh, we're abandoning them. I understand. Well, dear reader, shall we go? Oh shit, there's a fucking hole. That's like the O. When I went to my floor, I hang over the railing. Repeating this action every day, like a ritual. I stopped being afraid of heights altogether. That is not good. You should be afraid of heights because <laughs> you can die if you're careless. A few minutes ago, the effects of my medicine finally wore off. So I just enjoyed the blissful silence. Oh, I hope she doesn't die like her father falling. When I'm under the influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasant melodies sound in my head. Mixing with the sounds of the world around me, they create a terrible dissonance in my head. Ugh, sounds sorry. I'm sorry. 
I turn around and go to my apartment. Okay. That was scary there for a second. Oh. Hi. Did you drink the milk? Is that the mother of the girl? <laughs> Hi, mom. Did you bring the milk? Yes, mom. Did you did your new medicine help? Yes, mom. Go to bed. Yes, mom. Milk bot a shipment. Okay, we completed the game. I'm guessing there are several endings to this for sure, depending on the on the options you pick, like any visual novel. But I really enjoyed this. This was such an experience. To go through so many different emotions. Wow. It was very interesting. It was very creative, I think. <laughs> Let's have some meals to celebrate. <clears throat> well, you guys can play this game. It's free on Steam. So, oh no, maybe I bought it for like 50 cents. Yeah, I bought this game for like 50 cents. It was worth it. I think it was worth it. That was very interesting. There was kind of a touchy bar. There was a scary part. There was a... Oh, there was a some development here and there. Buy fifty cents new game for fifty cents. What is this? Wait, what? Huh? Load game. I don't know. Um, how do I exit the fucking game, mate? Uh... It's cursed! Close it. <laughs> okay, there are three achievements in the total, and I got two of them. I got two out of three achievements. I wonder what the last one is. <gasps> okay, that was an interesting 40 minutes game. I mean, I stopped here and there to read, but I think it was interesting. What do you guys think? You, may, you guys may have not liked it, but I understand. It was a very personal experience. That talked to me. That talked to me. It's 11.25. Been streamed for almost two hours. I think I'm going to call it. It was a cool just chatting game. I think. For Sunday. What do you guys think? Anything you want to talk about? Anything you want to... Do... It hurt your eyes. It had heart. Yeah, I think it was made with uh, with passion, right? It was it was. I like uh, the idea. I, I I always see that much red while I'm in altercation. Well, the the main character had a disease. They could always see red.
See you guys next time, guys. Have a good night. Love you. And bye-bye.